Yeah, that's right, it's the Make Code Minute. And what I wanna talk to you about today on the Make Code Minute is communicating between Circuit Playground Express boards using infrared. Uh, so if you take a look here in my Make Code session, uh, I've got just a very simple uh, sketch running where I have a button click input for A and a button click inf input for B. And both of those do a similar thing, which is they use this infrared send number block. And you'll find this over here in the network block. If you're wondering where infrared is, it's a network. So this infrared send, and I'm sending a one when I hit A, and I'm sending a two when I hit B. Now on the receiving side, I have this receiving block. It says on infrared received num, and that is the variable that it casts this incoming uh, message, this, this a uh, piece of data that comes from the infrared message. Uh, and what we're doing when we receive a number is I'm going to blank the LEDs by setting them all to black. And then I'm going to set a pixel color at whichever number value came in. And we have the 10 NeoPixel ring, so uh, pixel 0, 1, 2, 3, and so forth. So if 1 is the number coming through, then NeoPixel 1 is going to light up red. If 2 is the number that comes through, then NeoPixel 2 lights up red. So let's have a little demo here. Uh, you can see I've got actually the same program running on both of these. And on my sending board, I'm going to, in fact, I'm going to hold it up here so you can see it. And then I'm going to send by clicking the buttons. You can see that red LED is changing positions on the Circuit Playground Express as it receives infrared messages. It's that simple. That is how you send infrared messages between Circuit Playground Express boards using MakeCode.